April 28th is Workers' Memorial Day, a day of remembrance and action to mourn the dead and fight for the living. Never in the history of our union have we experienced such suffering and loss. So many of our sisters and brothers on the front lines have made the ultimate sacrifice to help others. Today, we honor those heroes who are no longer with us. Whether they were killed working on the road or caring for those with COVID-19, we honor each and every life. To ensure none of our sisters and brothers have died in vain, we must continue to fight the injustices and sustain worker health and safety. We know this will not be the last time we need to honor our fallen. However, now is the time to recommit to the fight for the living. We will do what it takes to save every life that we can. We need to stand together and say enough is enough. Every single worker deserves a workplace that is healthy and safe. No one should ever have to choose between their job and their life. We will persevere and just as we unified after 9-11, we must come together now. We have been and will continue to hold employers and government officials accountable for unsafe conditions and work with them to provide solutions in this new age. We will continue to innovate safety solutions and educate members and employers about our right to a safe and healthy workplace. Right now, we need everyone to do their part to keep our community safe. Speak up on behalf of your brothers and sisters. If you see something, say something. If not to your employer, then to your union leaders. We must protect each and every one of us any way we can. During this time of isolation and distancing, we need to connect to each other and our union now more than ever. Please join the fight. Whether you take a class or become an activist, our union needs you. With knowledge and the power of many, we can change the course of our lives for the better. Together, we can save lives. We must remain vigilant, and now is not the time to get complacent. We must do what we can, especially for our sisters and brothers entrenched in the heart of this epidemic. Please stay home if you can and follow all safety precautions and guidelines. The life you save could be your own. As a union, we are adapting and growing every day. We will survive this crisis together and we will be stronger because of it. To those brothers and sisters on the front lines, we thank you. To those staying at home to prevent the spread of this disease, we thank you too. When there is a call to help, we will respond. We are CSEA and proud of it. Our union is strong and will remain strong. We care deeply about each and every one of you and will be here for you no matter what. Nothing is more important than your health and safety. Thank you all from the bottom of our hearts for your dedicated and unwavering commitment to our communities and to our union. Stay well, stay safe, and stay strong.